Wensbury, a small town in Sandwell that I call home. A mysterious place in the heart of England that can't be found in an A to Z. It's just off Junction 9 of the bustling, chaotic M6 motorway. When I was a nipper, I remember moving to Wensbury with my mum and stepdad so they could open a cat sanctuary as a three bedroom house simply wasn't big enough for 50 cats. This place reminds me of John Coltrane, Canned Heat and Japanese director Kurosawa that filled my teenage life and inspired my dreams. I really wanted to be someone, a musician, someone who made a difference to others, people I didn't even know. This is Zatoichi, a cat who's had both his eyes removed and, unfortunately, nobody wants. Rumour has it that Queen Victoria, when passing through the black country on her royal train, asked to have the curtains closed. Was this so she couldn't see Wensbury, or so the locals weren't repulsed by seeing her? The recent regeneration of Wensbury, although closing down its vibrant markets and replacing it with a supermarket, has seen the arrival of a multi-million pound tram link and modern bus station. Some say this has ripped the heart out of Wensbury and made it just another town. I often want to leave and continue to change my dreams, but there's something stopping me. There's something about this place. There's something about Wensbury.